All right. So H Pain is the name. Dead by Daylight is the game. And today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to play as the survivor. Um, I'm gonna be using Meg Thomas. Uh, I almost have her at level 50, which is pretty good. But um, so off gate. I'm going to just let you guys know, you just got to be a low level survivor. Because none of the things I'm going to do is going to work with higher ranks. Just because, well, obviously, if you're in a higher rank, there's no reason for you to be watching this video. But if you are trying to get the hang of survivor, these are just a couple tips I know that uh, help me get. Like I said, I'm not the highest survivor, but it helps me, you know, get quicker into the, you know, the feel for survivor. Because playing a killer and playing survivor is two totally different things. So one thing I'd say is you just want to pick one survivor you want to go with and just stick with them um basically you see i have claudette to a level 15 and william uh bill to a, a 13 but you want to stick with one survivor and just try and rock it out until you get them all the way to the end basically level 50 and live them all the way up then once you do that you want to start getting the other survivors um and basically you just want to live them up one by one because then they get the teachable perks that you can teach to each one survivor and then at the end of the time once you get all of them you just basically pick one survivor you like the look of and then you just put the perks on there that's how it usually goes but um definitely just choose one survivor and just try and you know max her all the way out so i did meg just because with her loadout and everything or her perks you get sprint burst adrenaline which is really clutch um quick and quiet that's i think that's a teachable one i think these three are all teachables and then i just have resilience um which i might change that one um i might change that one to uh this one right here will make it because i mean you're being able to heal, heal people quicker but um with these basically you know it's kind of just to help you get out of situations that you know put you in put you in tough situations quick and quiet i mean if you're trying to get away from a killer but you're not in the chase you can basically you know hit a quick little turn and he won't be able to see you sprint burst once the killer first comes up on you you get those you know the three seconds where you can actually you know go real quick kind of like a i guess it would be some somewhat like dead hard just in more of a, a live state and then adrenaline you know if you're hurt you'll basically just be healed and you'll get the speed boost like with sprint burst into it so that's the three i run with that um i'm running this at the moment but i might just run like uh just probably a toolbox and i just throw on just certain things and if you have anything that can help you get blood points quicker so you can level up your player quicker you definitely want to throw it on there um, but yeah, so we're just gonna go ahead and get into the game and I'll just talk through it then All right, so we made it to the richest shop. Um, so first thing off gate What you want to try to do is just find try and find a generator Um, with me I can't necessarily sprint around just because I'll use it my sprint burst and I really don't want to do it But um, as you can see me and another guy got matched up together So I mean honestly, you don't want to try and work on the same gens with other people Okay, somebody, he's actually around me, so I'm gonna run. Um, but you never wanna work on, okay, so he actually found me. So I guess we're gonna hop into it real quick. So, uh, as you can see, he's on my ad right now. You wanna try and, uh, I don't know, I'm gonna try not to lead him around to other people. And I actually lost them. I'm surprised. Okay, like I said, you don't want to try and work on the same generator as other people. Um, you want to try and work on your own so we can, you know, you, you basically, you have four people so you can get four generators done as quickly or as quick as possible. Um, did he break this back this way? He did. Okay. So, um, I'm going to get down over here and start working on this generator, actually. So one thing you don't want to do, like how you saw, um, I think his name's Adam did, and as you can see him doing, like I said, you don't necessarily want to be working on the same generator as each other. You want to try and space out, which I mean, I guess this is okay for the time being. Um, all right, I saw him. I think he knows that we're coming this way. So I'm actually going to leave from that generator over there and come work on this one. I mean, I, I'm gonna just, uh, I don't think I brought him over here. I'm not gonna bring him to him. So I'm gonna try and run him off this way. Is he, oh, I ran into it. I didn't even pay attention. That sucks. I didn't try to run him over to that guy. I tried to, I wanted him to follow me, but he's not wanting to follow me. I like how he's just, just setting little things, batches up everywhere. It makes no sense. So, um, I'm actually gonna run back over here this way. I'm gonna just work on a generator as far as possible away from him. Um, we've got three of them done. Hopefully, that other guy or whoever else, because I've only seen 
two other people. I haven't seen the third one, so hopefully the third one is, you know, basically working on generators while we are running them around. So I'm actually, we're gonna get on this generator. I'm gonna go help that guy because I do have that part that helps me uh, quickly heal people. So I'm gonna just go ahead and hop on that. I don't wanna sprint just yet. Uh, Okay, so we only need one more done. I'm actually gonna sprint bump it. I ain't having to waste my sprint burst, but I mean, why not? That's how I feel. Where would he be going? He's coming right back this way. I don't believe he saw me. He did see me. I hope he's not gonna see and try and protect this guy. Oh, he saw me. <laughs> oh, well, that didn't work at all. Uh, That's definitely not where I wanna be. Is there not anything near me? Um. I think he just left me alone. Oh, they got him off the hook. Okay, that's good. Okay, so we need to be at least working. On, somebody needs to be working on a generator. I'm not to just trying to run with this guy. Or unless the guy is following him, then I'm not going to be following him. Alright, he's going to hit somebody else. Okay, I'm a... I have adrenaline. I just remembered that. Okay, so I can go basically go work on another generator and be fine. I'll be healed after this, so I'll be fine. Um, but I'm gonna heal him just because that's why I feel like adrenaline is a, adrenaline is a pretty decent one to do. Uh, go ahead and heal him real quick. You want to at least try and get as many blood points as possible and try and heal up people as quick as possible. Have all your teammates healed up. So um, I can't really remember where everything was. I think there was one back this way. One of the doors, that is. I think somebody just got him off the hook, yeah. All right, so uh, this is basically like one of the last tips of the game. Um, Oh, there he is right there. I don't know if he saw me or not. I think he probably just laid down like a little trap around there, but I'm already tormented, so I believe I can just run right through it and be fine. So the first thing you want to do is when you get, no, he actually didn't lay anything down. Um. Unless there's some, unless everybody's off the thing like this right now, then you can basically just open the door and be fine. But if you have people on the hooks and everything like that, you definitely don't want to open the door. You want to at least leave it like one tap. So as soon as you get there, you can just one tap it and be fine. Um, and everybody's basically all right. So I'm gonna wait on it for a second. I'm gonna see where everybody is. I see one guy. I don't really want to open it yet. But I'm not too sure what old buddy's doing. I think he's waiting. They may be. Okay, there he comes right there. There goes one. So there goes three guys. And the last one should be behind them. You just going to run out? We'll just run out, bump it. We'll just let him go. All right. So, I mean, that's basically it, man. Um, but, yeah, I mean, he wasn't the best killer um but when you're in this low of a survivor rank you're not gonna get the best killers that's why i said this is gonna work well for the tips i'm doing are gonna work well for you because you're not playing against the best killers you're playing basically against people that are about the same you know talent level as you like i said i'm not the best survivor but these things have definitely helped me out um when it came to you know oops i'm trying to put gg there it goes but um these things are definitely the best tips to use in the you know i guess the lower ranks um like i said you want to make sure you stick to one good character and just basically run it out with them until you can you know uh get them maxed out so you can teach all the perks to other people because i didn't know this but the perks that you you, you get the teachable perks come early in the other people's states so um i wish i want to start it with meg honestly i wish we would start with claudette because basically with claudette you can heal yourself um so if you haven't started working on somebody yet definitely work on her um she can heal herself without a med kit which is really good so basically you can bring a toolbox a flashlight something like that don't have to worry about a med kit because you can heal yourself but um like i said with meg though the adrenaline i feel like is really a good perk just because you can basically you know get out of there i mean you'll be hurt but it doesn't really matter because you get healed uh, at the last gym which i mean you could take a hit and try and like run them around until another gym's done so i mean there's a bunch of things you can do around you but yeah um i hope you guys enjoyed the video hopefully you got some tips out of this that were actually helpful to, to you or you didn't know about but yeah um 
that's it man i hope you guys enjoy the video i'll see you guys in the next video thank you